The following animation will explain and demonstrate exactly how the individual spin-to-stall roof bolting components function. The nut and bolt is manufactured with a hole that has been drilled through one side of the nut and halfway into the bolt. A shear pin is inserted into both holes. This locks the nut onto the bolt. The bolt can now be spun with the nut. After the hole has been drilled, the resin capsule is pushed into the hole. The bolt is pushed into the hole, thus piercing the capsule. The resin and catalyst from the capsule are now forced out, filling the space between the bolt and the surface of the hole. By spinning the bolt with a nut, the bolt mixes the resin and the catalyst. The resin sets so rapidly that it grips the bolt and resists the spinning. At this point, the shear pin snaps, releasing the nut. This stops the bolt from turning any further. Running up the thread, the nut then tightens the washer to the roof and tensions the bolt. Let us recap.